Right, very good morning. So today, um, this evening, Newcastle play Brighton. And um, it's going to be a very hard trip. But the, you know the thing is, right, there are no easy games in the Premier League. Now, in this short video, I'm going to talk about today's game and I'm going to give you a little about Group F. Okay, so later on we're going to be playing Brighton uh, half past five. Um, that's going to be on Sky Sports and I won't be watching it because I don't have Sky Sports anymore but I will still be cheering the team on now here's the thing right I've said this many times in videos right Newcastle United we need to adapt we need to change to step up to the plate now what I mean by that is this it's very simple we're an attacking team we are and we have some fabulous players we have new players Harvey Barnes Sandro Tonali and others now this evening, we need to go down to Brighton and show Brighton that we are better than they are. It will be very hard, that is true, but it's not impossible. And that's the point. You see, where we finished last season, to this season we're currently sitting 12th and in the last game we scored first but sadly we fell down in the later stages of the game well we've got to stop doing that and as I've said if many many times It's not about what happens on the sidelines with the likes of Eddie Howe and Jason Tindall. No. Because they, the opposition, will be expecting that. It's about the players on the pitch being able to change their ranks. And to change their ranks and their formation in the game. 10, 20 minutes of changing it so that we nullify the threat. If we can do that, we're going to conquer. And as I say, tonight I'm hoping for three goals from Alexander Isaac I'm hoping for um, maybe Tenali to smash one in and I think it's a toss up between Miggy and Harvey Barnes or it might be that um, as Anthony Gordon has recently scored maybe he wants another he's hungry you see the it's all about our players having that mentality to turn around and say when we're away from st james's park let's go get him and that's the point now like i say i'm hoping that we can keep a clean sheet today um, I know that um, Sven Botman was injured. Uh, 
I hope he has a fast recovery. But there's more players in our back lane last season. Wow. We were in very impressive. Now, the thing is, right, let's hope that the journey home for our travelling fans is better than it was the last time. So, that's what I'll say on today's match. Now, Group F. I watched um, Newcastle Fans TV with Sam and Harry. Now, they were on about the Champions League Group of Death. Well, all of the games which are in the Champions League are hard. But we earned that right to be in the Champions League by finishing fourth. Which, as many people know, I placed a £10 win. And that bet came in. So, I have the belief that we will get out of the group of death. Because at the end of the day, I believe it's possible to beat the three teams, Borussia Dortmund, PSG and AC Milan. That's where I believe, in my heart. And if that happens, then brilliant. So, as I say, all these games in the Champions League are going to be super hard. But if you want to win, that's what you got to do. you got to beat these teams. You've got to put the marker down. See, going back many years and years ago, right, at St James's Park, Barcelona came. And all of the pundits, they all turned around and said basically the same thing. It was like <laughs> they'd handed a script out to everybody to turn around and say, this is what you got to say. And they were all going on about Barcelona, right? Oh, the you know, it's going to be a good game, but Barcelona are going to come out winners. Guess what? Newcastle United changed that. The end score, 3-2. And it was all over the back pages of every newspaper. So we got to do the same again. But we got better players this time. And as I've just mentioned to Pete Graves, who is a reporter for Sky Sports News, I believe and nothing will stop me from believing Newcastle United can today win and as I say with the group of death we will come out of the group of death to the knockout stages so thanks very much for watching and have a wonderful Saturday.